Welcome to Fallout 76, this is Jim. In this video we're going to be taking a look at Hell's Eagles, which is a brand new quest that we got on March 26, 2024 update. As you can see, I am at the White Spring Refuge here on the map. And if you've been here since the update, you'll notice a little job board here. And you'll come across this poster here, it says Missing Jack Hunter. Now, I tried to, oh, there we go. <laughs> it worked this time. Jack Hunter, journalist. Contact Oscar Gonzalez, Esquire, <laughs> at the crater in Appalachia. Sounds good. There we go. Start quest, Hell's Eagles. So, just an FYI, I had a hard time activating this by reading this poster. <laughs> this is probably my fifth or sixth time trying to activate it. So what I actually had to do is I actually had to shut down my game, <laughs> open it back up, and that's and, and this and now it worked. Okay, so just an FYI, you may have to do that. That's what I find with these quests that we got during this past update, is they're a little glitchy. Okay. Uh so uh getting back to it here, let's take a look to see where we gotta go. So of course Crater is right up here. It is a free fast travel. So let's go ahead. Let's go right into the crater core. All right, so our retirement plan popped up. So that is a daily quest we could do for our daily challenges. So let's uh, get that off the screen. We'll toggle that off just like that. Okay, so Hell Eagles at the top right-hand corner of the screen. Speak to Oscar Gonzalez. Let's see this cat here. He, uh, right over here. Never should have thrown... Hey! Hey, you! <laughs> you seen a guy? Kind of... Uh... Squirrely guy with big sunglasses running around. Uh, Balding says he's a journalist. Can't say I have, butts. Damn it all! <sighs> what am I gonna do? Listen, my name is Oscar Gonzalez. I'm in some hot water with uh, some people. But my friend, Jack Hunter, he's chasing some story for his damn magazine. Now, I don't want to leave my friend alone out there in the wilderness, but I'm running out of time. We got to split, you see? So, I've got a job for you. If you're up for it, you go find my friend. Make sure he's safe and bring back any sign that he's alive. Do that, and I've got caps with your name on them. What do you think? Yeah, sounds good to me. Can't say no to someone in need, I'll do it. Caps for me. That's all you have to say. <laughs> Tell me more about this friend of yours. Yeah, let's talk about that. Jack is a human hurricane. I've done my fair share of living, but Jack is something else. He'll take you right up to the edge. But you never know if he's going to push you off or pull you back. At first, you might think he's a psychopath, and there's some truth to that. But underneath it all, he has an insight into everything that no one else has. He cuts through to the heart of things. <laughs> Maybe that's what brings on the madness. He sees things for what they are. He's one of a kind. Which is why I don't want him shivved to death in the mountains of Appalachia. <laughs> Fair enough. Okay, bud. Yeah, let's go ahead. So you don't even want the caps then, huh? <laughs> yeah. I'm joking. Now take this holotape. It's the only lead I have. Some kind of coded message. Guy is always doing stuff like this. Uh, maybe you can figure out what he's talking about. Uh, use it to track him down. Appreciate the help. Okay. Uh, so you saw it update the top right-hand corner of the screen. Listen. To the a lead at last hollow tape from your inventory. All right, so let's go ahead. We're going to open up our inventory here. Uh, let's go down here to hollow tapes right here. <laughs> let's go up to the top. Always speaking in riddles. Right there, a lead at last. Okay, let's go ahead and listen to it. Doctor G, I hope this message finds you well. Closing in on my target, a big man called Little Rob 
They say he lives somewhere in the mountains, in some kind of hideout. Now you might wonder who they are. I'm talking about people in the know. Squatters, prospectors, gold diggers. They say they've all had run-ins with the target. I met them in a shack up in the hills, up near a golf course that's seen better days. But I was not there for the greens. We huh. met up and made merry. Don't judge me. You're a merry maker yourself, you know. <sighs> they said they could take me to rob. I decided to follow. Dangerous, I know, but you have to take some risks if you're gonna get the big score. It's just how it is in this business. I'll see you on the other side. Hunter, out. Very cool. All right, let's back out. So I'll get it, uh, change the progress. Let's go to the prospector's hut. All right, let's open up our map here. Let's see where that is at. It had mentioned a golf course up to the north. I assume it was Hemlock Holes, what he was talking about. Uh, so go to the prospector's hut. It's up here. Um, so let's, um, let's go ahead. We'll go to the crosshairs. It seems to be the closest, and uh, we can always make our way down the hillside if we have to. Yeah, let's lock and load here, just in case. Let's see where we gotta go. Right down this way here, so we almost gotta go past them. That's alright, let's go here. Now, if you're brand new to the game, uh, even if you're not near a uh, area where there's, you know, buildings and stuff, you will come across enemies out in the woods, so uh, just an FYI there. I see there's a house up here I don't even have uh, found yet. Let's keep going, make sure we're going to the right spot. We are. That's good, new location. That's pretty good, let's go here. Oh, good stuff. Let's check around for some enemies. Don't see anyone around. That I uh, notice anyway. Let's be on the lookout for uh, that slurry shack. There we go. Nice. Brand new location. That's pretty cool. And of course, it's uh, right here. Slurry shack. I've been up here many times and never noticed this here before. So uh, let me know in the comments. Sure, someone will let me know. Let's check this place out here. Oh, we got some pork and beans. Let's grab that. Let's eat that, actually. Get some uh, purified water there. Nice. We got some beer. Oh, he's down for a, a beer there, too. Nice. Nice. So, cooking station. What else we got here? Let's check out back here. Oh, we got a little weapons workbench. Nice. Nice. Uh, looks like this uh, mine or part of a mine or something was maybe caved in. That's what's inside here. Nothing. Okay. Let's check this place out here. I'll keep the light on. It's funny how this tiny little shack it goes to a black screen. Speak to Surly. You lost? You don't look like any prospector I've ever seen. Not that that's a problem. We like to take in strangers. They can be... fun. Huh. Looking for a journalist. Balding with glasses. His name's Jack Hunter. Oh, you're a friend of that guy. <laughs> he was a riot. Nobody partied like that man. Never seen someone take so many chems and stay standing. He huh? came in here looking to talk to some blood eagles. Um, some of my friends knew where to find them. They took him up to the crosshair in the mountains. That's Little Rob's territory. Uh, or so I hear. Don't think they're coming back. Say, do you party like your friend? <laughs> I've got some buffed out, buff out. You'll never know what hit you. Uh, or in a good way. Intelligence plus four, buffed out, buff out. 
Is it a modified in some way? Yeah, modified to be a blast. Way huh. better high than the normal stuff. And none of those nasty side effects. Oh, good. Free chems, yeah, sign me up. <laughs> yeah, that's what I like to hear. Here, take that sucker and get as high as you like. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to uh, regret Anything this. I can do for you? Okay. Good stuff. Let's uh, check out this little uh, cabin here. Forgot that. Bladed tire iron, huh? You can say I've seen one of those before. It's dangerous. Ten millimeter pistol. Oh, I got Surly's note here. Let's take a look at that. All right, Surly. You know the drill. It took a hell of a lot of spiked buff out, but I think we finally have this hunter guy down for the count. Oh, wow. We'll take it back up to the crosshair and Rob can decide what to do with him. We won't make him our jester. Seems like a funny guy. Seems like a waste to eat. <laughs> Such a scrawny man. Wow. Wow, that's rough. Is she going to attack me? Oh, so much for her. Now she's just a pile of uh, nuclear waste. <laughs> Surly. <laughs> I love it. I love it. <clears throat> I love it. I don't know why I like that so much. That really, uh, really made my day. <clears throat> Set outside. <laughs> oh, good stuff. <laughs> All right, good stuff here. We got a uh, nice little spot here. Cool. Uh, so again, the crosshairs is uh, just up here. That's where we fast travel to. So let's go ahead and fast travel back up there. So we're going to go up and try to climb that mountain. Alright, so there are going to be some blood eagles here. Usually about uh, five or six here on the outside. Let's go ahead. Um, what do I got here for grenades on me? I got a couple. Let's uh, drop that. I don't need that. It's just going to weigh me down. Get that guy with the missile launcher. Anyone else? Oi. He's hiding. He's hiding over there. I want no part of that cat. That lunatic with his uh, unclaimed plasma rifle. Nice little uh, power armor set here. You guys can grab. We've been up here many a times. This this place isn't isn't new. We know that. Yeah, we'll grab that. We'll grab that stuff. Sure. Grab some more ammo here. Um, into little Rob's hideout. Where is that guy at? Over here. So, um, if you guys remember the last update that we had, the, um, this here was called the Deserted Mine. And uh, it was brand new, if, and, and I made a video on this on my channel if you want to check that out. So there'll be some blood eagles and maybe a couple of mole miners in here. But it was actually called the Deserted Mine. It uh, didn't really have a spot of its own. It was just called, you know, the Crosshair, like this. But you can check out that video if you so wish. Because uh, it was new, maybe just like a couple months ago. Um, short plus. Okay, let's go inside little Rob's uh, hideout. That's pretty cool. Actually has a name now. Again, there's going to be a bunch of blood uh, blood eagles down here, so we're going to take care of these cats. Let's lock and load, Jim, if we can. I'm going to do some, pick up some stuff here at the same time. Uh, defeat the Blood Eagles, 
We'll let them come to us. Uh, there's usually a uh, higher level one with uh, power armor on. Typically. And we'll just let them uh, come to us here. Sure no one's flanking us from the other side. <laughs> he poked his head out there, see that? Oh, I love these guys. These guys are so fun. <laughs> these guys are hilarious. Okay. Speak to Jack, okay. <clears throat> Let's grab these uh, can chimes here. Excuse me, Jeepers. Losing my uh, voice. I'm having voice issues this morning, personally. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I see a bunch of mole miners in there uh, on the fire. Cook it. I didn't know these guys were, uh, you know, were that way. Eat other uh, folks there. Cannibals, I didn't know that. Uh, let's head up here for a second. Now again, you guys can check out that video I made in Accessible. So you, uh, normally we're able to make our way through here. It's just like a little, uh, storage room. Yeah, see, it's just a little storage room and there's a bunch of goodies in there, but, uh, I'm not too sure if we can still, if we get in there anymore. Uh, lots of goodies in here. Miner suits, scrap. Bunch of mole miner gauntlets. You can scrap them to get the third uh, finger there. What do you want to call it? All right, let's talk to our old pal here. Is this a hallucination? Nope, I'm real, buddy. What happened here? What did you do? <laughs> oh my lord. I killed all these blood eagles. You're welcome. You what? You psychopath! All my interviewees are dead. Now what am I gonna do? I put you up to this. Are you with the family? I paid that debt. Is, is it Buttercup? He's out to ruin me, isn't he? Buttercup. A man named Oscar Gonzalez. He said you were a friend of need. Wanted some sign that you're alive. Oscar? No, oh, but... Of course, but I sent him my holotape. He, he should know better, but... Uh, yeah, it figures. He's probably whacked out on Psycho, that one. Uh, oh, all right. Huh? I, I understand now. Uh, but I can't leave without my story. I came here to interview little Rob, and that's what I intend to do. Oh. So since you killed off half my article, I think it's only fair you come with me. Besides... Watch that. I'll need the help considering how many chems I just took in the latrine. Do that, and uh, I'll give you a note proving I'm alive and kicking. Yeah, those are nice glasses. Yeah, that sounds good to me. <laughs> You're high right now. You sound perfectly coherent to me. Why did you take a bunch of chems if you are supposed to be interviewing Blood Eagle Warlord? Want me to come with you to interview the boss of a bunch of Blood Eagles I just murdered? No way. I think I'm just going to go now. Yeah, we're going to go with them, of course. That's right. Glad you see it that way, too. Now, uh, these chems I took, they're, uh, they're pretty strong. I, I, I may need you to do some talking for me, and <laughs> you should expect to. And, uh, little Rob, warmonger that he is, has a hot temper. He's liable to fly off the handle at the slightest insult. So, yeah, like all blood eagles are, yeah. Or you'll have to do to him what you did to his minions here. Then yeah, sounds good to me. I have no story. But, but, but we'll cross that bridge if we come to it. It's it's time to get going. Okay. Enter the throne room. I'm thinking that's where we're going. That's the part that's inaccessible. Isn't this cool, eh? Little bumper car here. Okay, good stuff. Get out. Before I get angry. Well, if it isn't our guest of honor. Was it you that woke me up with all that racket? Hey, who the hell is this? No one to worry about, Rob. 
this is uh, my uh, assistant. Late to the party as usual. All right, let's interview uh, Buddy here. Take a wake up from a beauty. <laughs> Expect that I want on interview. And now I got this sprung on me. I don't like this, Jack. <laughs> it seems suspicious. And you know how I get when I'm suspicious. Steady, Rob, steady. No need for suspicion. We're all friends here. Uh, re remember the card games. Remember the cams. Friends, right. Those cams were pretty good. That's right, friends. Now, okay, uh, let's get through this interview before I'm halfway to the moon. First question is... Huh? Uh, assistant, remind me what the first question was again. Oh, my lord. It was, tell me about your uh, brutal rise to power. Yeah, yeah, right, right. The brutal rise to power. Uh, walk <laughs> us through. Walk us through it. Ah, <laughs> story for the ages. You see, it all began with crazy eyes, a shipment of psychos, and a poker game. Ivan was the last warlord of the Crosshair. I was a young pup with big ambitions. I didn't like the cuts of psycho I was getting from Ivan. I wagered my life for all the psycho he had. In a game of five card stud, best two out of three. We each won a game. But I won the tiebreaker. Bastard thought he could bluff me, <laughs> but I knew better. After taking all his psycho, I ran him off the mountain. Who knows where he ended up? Doesn't matter to me. I'm the top dog now. Who cares about crazy Ivan? Good, 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 good. Doing well. Next question. Yeah, what was the next question again, assistant? The bloody goes following the kind of guided principles. How do you recruit more members? You feel like there's more to life than slaughtering the innocent? <laughs> Obviously not. Um. Yeah, do bloody goes follow any kind of guided principles? How about that one? Lord, a philosopher. <laughs> Might makes right. That's our guide and principle. We don't need <laughs> more than that to get our way. Getting our way is all important to us. Some people out there will try to scam you into thinking we can go back to how we used to live, but we can't. The sooner we get used to that idea, the better off we'll all be. Food for thought. <laughs> yes, uh, uh, jot that down, assistant. Now the final question. The big kahuna. Assistant, no, no. This one, I'll handle myself. I have to. The currents of fate have thrust it upon me and me alone. No matter what my cognitive state, little Rob. When you peer into the cosmic mirror and your soul stares back blackened by the violence of its existence, <coughs> it asks, what was the point of it all? How do you respond? What? <gasps> he wants to know what motivates you to keep living as a bloody go warlord. He's asking how you live with your monstrous, <laughs> monstrous life decisions. I think he's wondered how you like your barbecue. <laughs> Top one. you even need to ask I want to be on top who would we all scrape steal and kill our way to a better life nowadays and of all the blood eagles in the crosshair I got it best why because I took what I needed huh. simple as that the soft underbelly of little Rob revealed yes yes that is exactly what I was looking for. Good work. Well, that concludes our interview. I think I got plenty of material to go on. Rob, you have been a magnificent host. I don't know if we'll meet again, but uh, 
If we do, save some of that buff out for me. And you. You were as good an assistant as I could have hoped for. You can head back to Oscar. This node will prove I'm safe, but I'm getting out of here. We're both gonna want to lay low for a while after what we've been through. Don't worry. Once he gets word, you'll know to head to our rendezvous spot. So rest assured, I'll, I'll meet up with him eventually. All right. Good luck out there, there, Pally boy. Luck? Yes. Never been too kind to me, but I'll take your well wishes just the same. You know, despite everything, I have to admit I won't forget our chance encounter today. A journey into a den of darkness, a chance encounter with a murderous psychopath. No, 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 two! <laughs> yeah, it'll make a hell of an article. Keep an eye on the newsstands. And, uh, farewell. That sounds good. Good stuff. All right, speak to Oscar, who is back at the uh, crater. Look at this cat here, little Rob. <laughs> you gonna hang around all day? <laughs> I love it. What do you got here, bud? Grab these here, right in front of him. I'll uh, close this door, pal. Let's get a carry weight booster in us so we can. Uh, fly out of here. There we go. And there goes our pal. Crater. Crater's right up here, Jim. Let's pop back over there. Fast travel. Oh, I meant to go to the crater core. That's okay. That's alright. This guy is in the buff. Oh, he's got his clothes on now. See, that's how they all are when uh, when no one's around, and then when sh someone shows player shows up, they put their clothes on. <laughs> well, that's not too bad. Not too bad at all. I could have used the uh, circuit breaker there. Didn't have to bring. I thought we were gonna go to an expedition or something. That's why I kept the uh, plasma rifles there. All right here's Oscar. Let's talk to him. I can't wait much longer, friend. You ever find out what happened to Jack? Jack's fine. He's got it over his head, but he's safe now. Here's a note for proof. That son of a rendezvous point. What the hell does that mean? Is he talking about it? How am I supposed to get there? Ugh. <laughs> hey, look, this isn't your problem anymore. If he's safe and wants to meet there, then that's all that matters. Here's that reward we talked about. Now, I've got to go get myself out of hot water. Alone. That bastard. <laughs> 200 caps, there we go. Hells, Eagles. Quest completed, done. Nice, that's awesome. It's nice having the, nice doing these little quests uh, that are part of the game now. It's pretty awesome. I like it. Got some good stuff there, looks like. Let's uh, check that out. Go to our new section here. Uh, we got a plan for the Civil Engineer Asbestos Lining. Civil Engineer Lighter Build. Okay, good stuff. That's awesome. That's awesome. Uh, we also got a recipe here. Disease Cure for the Ash Heap. Apparently, I don't know this. That's awesome. And uh, that's pretty much it there. There's that Surly's buff out we got from Surly. Uh, plus two strength, plus two endurance, 25 max health for five minutes. Increases thirst, so that's pretty cool. That's Surly's uh, buff out. But yeah, there we go. We got some new uh, plans, uh, some mods for that civil engineer. Now, I made a video showing the civil engineer set, which includes the helmet, torso, uh, both arms and both legs, and I, I put it on, and the little light works on the helmet which is just a regular helmet that you can wear with any outfit. Uh, but the uh, the other armor, it's, it's not too bad. Uh, it does have, if you wear all five pieces together, it comes with like a little bit of a buff to it. But you can check out that video. I'll put it at the end of this one so you can check that out. But uh, not too bad. We didn't have to do an expedition there today. Uh, and that's fine with me. 
kind of take a little break from that place. Uh, but yeah, I hope you guys, that was a real easy quest. Uh, it's nice doing these little quests. You nice doing something different in the game. It's so old Caleb Fisher back there. Photo bomb in there. I <laughs> uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, and share when you have the chance. It really helps me out. I'd like to thank my channel members, Artistically Arranged, Boogadoo Bronson, Michael Edwards, Nigel Whiffen, Heather, White Tribe Starwind 138. Thank you all so very much. And I hope you all have a nice day.